Good evening, guys. Thank you so much. Thank you, Realty Next, for this opportunity. So, I am Sheikh Ziaur Rahman. I am the co-founder and CBO of Paving Plus. We welcome you to the uh, world of Paving Plus, where we are on a mission to recycle waste plastic, to rebuild infrastructure, and to reimagine greener world. Let me take you through. We are in 2018. We identified two major problems. The first problem is the plastic waste. All these plastic waste which we are generating every day. Nothing happens to it. It goes to the landfills. It goes into the oceans, and it is uh, it is in our ponds, and it is also India is number right now in the top list of plastic polluter. So as as we move on to the second problem, the pollution from the construction industry. So we are right now the pollution industry is 37 percent of global greenhouse gas emission is emitted from this industry. 3.3 billion metric tons of CND waste is generated annually. Also, 5 billion metric tons of uh, new natural resources like stones, like uh, other other different items, are consumed annually. By embedding these two problems, we have found out a solution, a more durable, more eco-friendly, more sustainable solution, where we are making construction road materials like paver blocks, paver tiles. Like these, these is made from 20 to 30 percent waste plastic, as well as we have a patented process where we are making it from more than 80 percent waste plastic. So we have two different processes. One is patented, the other is a normal process. In the first process, the P20 process, we use 20 percent waste plastic. So we use that 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 much amount of waste, and we replace the concrete part of the of the total mix. So we use 20% of the waste plastic. In the second process, that is the patented process, we use more than 80% of waste plastic and we make paver blocks and paver tiles like this. So let me tell you the comparative analysis. So as per traditional paver blocks and paver tiles for roads which you normally use, our products are 2.5x uh, more stronger. It has greater load bearing capacity. The tensile strength is more than 36.5 MPa as tested by us in the national laboratories. Also, the weight has been reduced from 5 kilo to 2.5 kilo, which is easier for your operations and easier for laying the paper blocks. Also, there is no water curing required. So, we are saving a lot of water on ground. So, we are not doing, you don't require water curing because it is plastic waste. Also, the water absorption is less than 1%. So, no degradation of concrete. And uh, there is obviously no degradation of plastic waste. So Ranjan Kumar Gupta is the founder and CEO. Uh, he is a B.Tech in civil. So he has done his masters from uh, from Calcutta Heritage University. I am uh, Sheikh Zia Rahman. I am the co-founder and CBO. So I have done my bachelor's in economics from Calcutta University. I have done my masters from IIM Rachi. We have different mentors from different backgrounds. So we have uh, Plastic Man of India on board. Uh, Professor Dr. Shadhan Kumar Ghosh is a waste management expert. Dr. Sami Joshi is a permanent member of United Nations. And Aki Hussain is a venture builder expert. So we are talking about a total market size of 2,80,000 crore, out of which we have a serviceable available market of 96,000 crore. And we have a share of market of more than 500 crore we are targeting in the next five years. So as we are impact first startup, so we have done a lot of impact on ground. We have uh, total done 15 lakh square feet of materials we have paved. We have reduced more than 570 metric tons of CO2 from the environment. We have saved 80 kiloliters of water. Also, we have reduced 285 metric tons of waste plastic from the landfill as well as oceans. Social impact, we have generated around 40 direct employment and 100 indirect employment. Also, we are targeting rag pickers who are in the lower strata of the society. So, these rag pickers, we have increased their wages by 30% by as they collect MLPs, multi-layer plastic from the environment and they give it to us for recycling. These are some of the awareness initiatives which we have done in Bengal. These are some of our clients. So, we have institutional projects, real estate projects, we have industrial park projects and other different projects. These are some of the projects which we have already completed. Uh, some of them are industrial park projects, some of them are uh, petrol pumps, some are, some are there for parking, parking area projects. 
this is some of the projects which we have done uh, one in bangalore we have done and other in calcutta thank you so much please join us in our mission and let's make a difference together we seem to have any questions ma'am what is a disposal strategy for these pardon ma'am how do how do you dispose these if you have to yeah so after after using this paper blocks you can generally you can again recycle so we are there to recycle these type of blocks again so and for how many times can you recycle right now uh, we have done one time because we have been two years in the construction space so paper block generally last for around 7 to 8 years so that time frame hasn't been come yet so that we could know how much time we can all recycle recycle but it can be recycled again and again but you mean the last 7 to 8 years as in the top layer there's attrition of the top layer yes, because yes. of usage yes, yes and yes. what is the time what is uh, Total your paper top layer life is yeah. 12 to 15 years 12 to 15 years yeah What's the cost differential between this one and the normal? So it's the same. It's, it's so the same. Yes, same it's price. Same. For we are selling at the same price. We have a lesser cost, but see, we are selling at the same price. <laughs> <laughs> What are your revenues for the year? So last year we did around 3 CR. We are targeting this year around 8 CR. And profitability? Yeah, we are profitable. We have a beta of six and a half percent. Six and a half. have you done uh, so what is the feedback like uh, um, in terms of the strength and i can see that it's very light compared yes. to the normal product but in terms of strength and everything how how what is the feedback like and how long do they last compared to the normal concrete block so we have done accelerated testing and it can last more than 12 to 15 years as per the life cycle of this also in terms of the compressive strength the traditional block has a compressive strength that uh, translates to 80 metric ton to 100 metric ton this has more load capacity of more than 150 metric ton so you can put 25 elephants all together in this block nothing will happen and what about the india is a very hot country concrete is normally blamed for all the heat which gets dissipated or generated it remains hot for a longer period of time what what is this the can factor resist of heat up to around uh, 89 to 90 degree celsius okay okay in terms of certifications testing certificates uh, you not shown anything are we like certified across yes yes we have certified we have tested we have been given grants for that only so we have tested our products through nabl to national testing house we have accorded with the all the is codes is 15 uh, 15168 of uh, the civil code so everything is tested in that way so it is building green building certified kind of we are also taking green pro certification which is the igbc certification normally so the builders can get green points out of that uh, you mentioned that you are planning to basically double 2.5 x your revenue this year yes. right so are you upgrading your manufacturing capabilities yes, accordingly yes sir so right now we have a capacity of around 3000 square feet we are upgrading to 1 lakh square feet per month